maybe try to put more pressure through your uh, heel. I, I try to displace my, my weight from my heel to my toes, like kind of all three spots. Yeah. And I think about pushing the floor apart, rotate my knees a little out. I've been flying from town to town. Good morning. It is 7 a.m. show day. Moment I've been waiting for. We woke up this morning, we did our check-ins with Kyle. I am just about seven pounds heavier than I was the morning of summer shredding. It's like pretty insane. It just goes to show how depleted I was that we were able to add back so much fullness and maintain conditioning because my pictures really do look like I'm still that conditioned. As we pull water out, I'm just gonna get drier and drier. Objective here, we're gonna carb up a little bit. Um, this is low protein, more fats and carbs. That's pretty much how the whole day's gonna go. So this is what we got for breakfast. So I got two whole eggs, three pieces of bacon. Then I have 45 grams of cream of rice. That's about 30 grams of carbs. Then I have 28 grams of Rice Krispies, which is about 25 grams of carbs. And then he said to do two cracks of salt, but I've been doing consistently half teaspoon portions. So I'm just gonna do one half teaspoon with this meal. And I'm gonna put it right on the eggs. I don't really get water with this meal. So the digestate and the glucose, we're gonna have to use some saliva. Ah. Meal one is down. It is uh, 7.25, tanning is at eight. We're about eight minutes away. Not even, we're like four minutes away from the venue. That's where tanning's at. So we're gonna head over there and get tanned a little early. Athlete check-ins at eight. I gotta take pictures at 8.30 for Kyle. We're gonna try and front load, get in there a little early. And uh, if not, we're taking our pictures on the road. Let's hit the car. YouTube, this is Tom. Me and Tom were roommates for the first two years of college, and we played football together for four years. Fuck yeah. He's still fucking coming to support me. My man. It's game day. It's a party in the backfield. Game day, baby. Party in the backfield today. Time to go. It's too late. It's hard to Stage by like 11:30, probably, you know. Yeah, that's fine. How's your stomach? Good. Yeah, it's empty. I'm hungry, but um, my you stomach just. I have beef. Yeah. We are tanned up. I slipped a 20 to the tanning girl, and she made me extra dark. This is probably as dark as we're gonna get ever. Feeling really good. Just took my pictures, sent them to Kyle. I'm 168 right now, so I woke up like just about seven pounds over my last stage weight two weeks ago. So we've filled in a lot, and the lines are still there. I'm still feeling very dry. My legs are super dry when I wake up, which is a really good feeling. That means we're not holding water there. My legs is really not the problem. The upper body is where I'm probably lacking a bit of the push. We are going to have a very light meal right now, because uh, I was 
fed pretty decent this morning on the carbs. I got beef and asparagus coming out of the microwave right now. We are doing 105 beef, 90-10 beef, and 100 grams of asparagus. I'm gonna salt it lightly and try to keep these things very controlled. I get no fluids with this meal. We are, what, it's like 9.30? We're about eight minutes away from the venue. The athlete check-in starts at 10, so I'm gonna pack up my bag. Uh, we're gonna get over there, and I'm probably gonna get on stage maybe around like 11.30, so we'll have one more meal after this one in about an hour with six ounces of coffee. So I gotta get this down, get back over to the show, and uh, I'm just feeling super good right now. Zan is getting off stage soon. Jack here is desperate for some what, Buffalo Wild Wings. Yeah, we're going to Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> What's up, big dog? Is that the new lens? No, no, it's in my bag. That's in the bag? Yeah, this is my wide angle. Hell yeah. I love it when you talk dirty, camera to me. <laughs> Yeah, Yo, you gotta change your monotone in your videos. Get some personality. Yeah, we're talking about that. I want, and I want, to, hear, I want to hear you about what? what Be energized about your content, not like, hey guys, this is chicken and rice. It took me a while to try. Before it was even worse, it was like, alright, so be able to. I tried, but like, it doesn't come out. You gotta do it like you're talking to me right now. I know. You know I what know. I mean? Like, I don't say it's very good like that. Yeah, pretend like, 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 like you're talking to someone. Yeah, it's just hard. It's so funny. I love it. You guys show off your life. What's up, team? How we doing? You hear us? All I heard you. <laughs> I heard you. I'm sweating my ass off. We competed in 105 degrees down in Houston, and this is hotter. Recently. What's up, bro? What's up? Good. How you doing? Good. You look good. You look confident. Yeah. Bro, because I, I know. I know I'm in shape and I know I can pose. I just need to pack some, pack some fucking steak somewhere. Yeah. Like, like inject steak. Thank you. Hey, look, yo, you're posing. A1, bro. Really? A bro, A1. I was like, yo, that motherfucker is You thinking both? Hell yeah. Really? All right. Absolutely. I love to hear that. I appreciate that. Yeah. Oh, shit. 10, 15 pounds. Yeah, dude, that's really all it is. I know I just need more size. That's all. Dude, I rushed my off season with my skin. I really didn't have yeah, to get issues with it. Yeah, so yeah. it's like, I knew where I was going to be at. I'm just getting done next year. Dude, nah, two years. Two years. Two years. Two years. Two years. Two years. I'm just going to be eating and growing. That's it. So you practice your posing a lot, obviously. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, I drill posing all the time. And then I have two posing coaches. I got one that does, like, men's physique. I've only done three sessions with her. Uh, I just did my third session with her between the shows. And we changed a couple things. Like, I hit my obliques a lot harder now. Are you gonna hug me? I appreciate that. So proud. Thank you. Thank you. I try. I gave my best. Proud my darn best. Dude, listen, it's just starting. It's just the start, dude. Yeah, man. Dude, it's like literally just the beginning. The beginning. Like it's just like for every single one of us. Like undeniable. It's like literally just like undeniable. Jaren literally still has a regular job. In six months, that'll be non-fathomable. It's ridiculous. How you doing? I'm doing. I forgot to drink that 16 ounces of water. No. <laughs> Only thing I said to do. Looks better than uh, summer shredding. Yeah. You're fuller. We need the fuller. Yeah, you're better. And your stage presence is much better. Summer shredding, you came out like this. This, you actually came out like, you like big. Your pose is awesome. All the time. Literally. Yeah. And we say that all the time. Really? It's like, it's yeah. so seamless. It's almost like it's so enjoyable. You're going to do it overall. You won't win overall. We're going to get to the 2.30. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's the closing is just spot on. Today's the last day that I even call me skinny because I'm going to go fucking ham. All right, you guys want to run and go get your food and meet me back at the cribbo? Cool. I'll see you there. Life of Jack and Lou. We're over at Buffalo Wild Wings. We're going to go grab some lunch real quick. We're going to be fat asses for a little bit. You know it. And then we're going to head back and go see Zanny Boy. Oh yeah, peace. It's hotter in this 
show yeah, than it is in Houston. Like, I, I can't stop saying that. Like, it is disgusting back there. But Kyle just fed me 165, 99, one ground turkey and 100 grams of asparagus. So no carbs, no fats, this meal. Do you have any idea what time I got on stage? Because it must have been new. 1.30. Really, it was that late? Yeah. Dude, I was standing there starving. Dude. I was going flat. So they I, didn't start till at least one. So I had Sour Patch watermelons, and I ate like six of them before mm -hmm. I went on for Classic. And then I was standing there waiting for physique, and I started going flat again. And I started going hypo and getting cold chills, but I was sweating. I'm really happy with how I posed, how I presented. Um, I felt really confident, and I just want to get back up there. And if I have the same look, if we can hold the same look, I'll be really happy. So, just feeling blessed. You're the best. <laughs> on your toe. <laughs> like, give me like your outlook on the on the show. Give me something. You look great. Posing was money. Yeah. Money. Look way fuller than summer shredding. Ah, uh, yeah, solid. Yeah, man. My parents have arrived yes, they have. for finals, and my mom is overdoing dishes, so I'm a, I'm a very lucky guy. Ma, say hi. 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 <laughs> We are, what, what time is it? 4.59, I have a five o'clock meal. We're gonna get on stage probably about 6.45, closer to seven, final start at six. So I will probably get one more meal at about 6.30 before I get on stage, and it'll likely be this as well. So we're doing 99 one ground turkey, 90 grams of jasmine rice, and then I get another 56 grams of Rice Krispies with 20 grams of almond butter. That all together is like 75 grams of carbs, maybe like 20 grams of protein, and then like 15 grams of fat. Keeping the protein low so that the food goes fast, so I can still pull a vacuum in about two hours. Love you, bro. Go out there, do it. All right, yes, you gonna hear me. And then I'm proud of you. I appreciate you. We're about to head over to finals, and looks like I'm sitting in fourth at the moment. I don't really care about the placings, but I'm about to put on a show. I am so locked in and excited, and the excitement I had coming off stage, I'm about to bring that twofold right now. This is my last shot right now to make the most of this memory, see if we can edge out a third place, get in the top three. At the end of the day, I am so proud of what we put together. Kyle, thank you, brother. You have my back for the last three years, and I, I, wanna, I wanna thank everybody individually, but for you, you gotta know, you are my big brother. You have led me so far away from where we started and I am so excited for where we're gonna be. I'm about to make you proud, I'm about to make my parents proud, my sister proud, my whole, my, my family here. My friends are not my friends, they're my family. And I am jacked up. And I hope every single one of you that's watching this feels this feeling at some point. That something means so much to you. You are so passionate about the people that are around you that you just wanna impress them, make them proud, and make them feel every bit of love back. So I'm about to go over there and put my headphones in. I'm gonna eat another meal, and I'm gonna dance on that on that stage. There's not a damn thing anyone can do about it. Let's go. Alright, so we're at finals right now. Waiting for Zan to get on. I'm hype. He's hype. We're all hype. Zan, when you see this, I love you, bro. So proud of you. They already clapping for you. And most importantly, undeniable, baby. <laughs> Go, Zan! Like you, be strong to hold the powers of the sun. To dream. So 
Zan came in eight pounds heavier for this show. He looks much better. His closing routine was 10 times better. Uh, his placing was better, so that's good. He's going in the right direction. He placed fourth. Yep, he placed fourth for Classic. And then he's coming up now uh, for Men's Physique, which he'll probably place fourth as well. But overall, I'm really proud of him. It's been great to watch his, his prep this past you know, three months. He's really inspired me and kind of made me fall in love with bodybuilding again. So, Zan, I'm very proud of you, and I can't wait now to start growing with you. What's up, baby? We out here. But Gary didn't plug his fucking mic in my, in my a couple of my clips. I was like, bro, I'm like talking with my mom, and it's like, I'm like, fuck. But it's okay, Gary. I still did a good job. I love you. But Zan, fucking kill this shit, baby. Very proud of you. Love you, Zan. Good work. I'm happy for you. And proud of you. Mic check one, two, one, two. I brought me, man. Who brought you? Ooh. I wasn't done. Yo, you might have to check out these orchid bars. This isn't paid sponsorship. I'm about to eat this whole fridge. <laughs> uh, undeniable. <laughs> What is this? Just eat it. Looks good. Oh, it's fucking good. Who made that? I should have been third at least, but whatever. Of course. I know. Thank you. Just what you said. So I place things aside, I'm happy. Hi. Hi. Okay, you can Damn. You hear that? What up, baby? Thanks for coming, bro. Yo, moose! I hear those trunks add like three pounds. Hey, yours. What up, baby? You're out, bro. You know, you look so handsome out there. Yeah, you think? Tom is so proud. You're the best. Thank you so much. Thank you for washing my trunks, too. Of course. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. So happy. Yeah, Undeniable. Undeniable. Wait, wait, wait. I got weight. No, no, no. Go, go, go. I love you. Wait, can I take Yeah. What yeah, is out. in here? No, we gotta go. We gotta go. Wait, it's what? It's egg white. Egg white. It's so good. Egg white ice cream. What? It's made from real work. This is fire. Who made you? It's amazing. What should I do first? I mean, actually, what should we do? Yeah, what should we do first? That's the question. You ain't eating shit. <laughs> I think I'm doing Captain Crunch. Crack that bitch open. That's nice. That's nice. I'm like shaking. I see you shaking. Oh. I'm like vibrating. That's good as hell. That's really good. You make them? Yeah, I'm making them all myself. Taylor's cookies. She's Taylor. Oh, she is Taylor. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it was good. Strawberry pop star. Taylor's cookies. Very good. All right, we got strawberry pop star. Thank you. Bro, what dieting did you do? Is that your trophy? Yeah. 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 I don't want. I'm getting better. I'll see you in a little bit. Oh my God. Jeez. <laughs> I'm gonna get the rest of the flavors on camera a little bit because we gotta go to dinner. Yeah, for sure. But I'm gonna put you up. And I'm gonna put new flavors out. Hell yeah, you are. And then we're gonna keep doing this thing. 100%. I'm gonna come to Kingdom. I'm gonna get a session in and then we're gonna crush cookies. I'm down. Cool. In two weeks, I can eat them with you. Two weeks? Two weeks. Let's do it. Crush your shell, we'll crush some cookies. 100%. We're on a mission now. Now, prepped over. You know what that means? It's time to eat. You know where we're going? 230 pounds. We're going to Centrada. 
in Red Bank. And I'm gonna order the Wagyu tomahawk. And if somebody doesn't split it with me, I'm buying the whole damn $270 <laughs> steak, damn it. So subscribe, cause that YouTube revenue ain't tall enough for a fucking $270 <laughs> steak. And I got an expensive ass off season ahead of me and with a lot of food. Hello. Heading inside, got a shower, see you guys when we get dressed. This is the third cookie that I got from them. The hot fudge sundae. Let's see how this is. How's that look? It looks pretty gas. That was good as hell. Here, everybody, get in here. Whole squad gets in. Oh, I know. <laughs> bro, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, <laughs> I think no. I'm, 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 I'm five second rule, bro. We'll fish them. Wow, that is really good. Hot fudge sundae. Make it better off the board. Shout out Teller. <laughs> That's money. That's yeah. money. Ooh, we're gonna order some Taylor's cookies tomorrow. This makes me smile. Oh! Alright, Sully Brownie. And I'm a slug. Wait, wait, over there. You were definitely a slug. Oh, that's a here. Oh, that's good. <laughs> You're the best girlfriend. <laughs> yes. I think I did good. Yes. I did well. Oh, sir. Yeah. Hello. Reeks. Let's have a meal. Let's have a meal. Let's have a night. Hey. They talked me into fucking coming. Yeah, we didn't have too much talking. Yeah. I'll see. We're over here at Centrada's. We got the squad. Yeah, say it with the little Spanish accent. Yeah, we have our local Spaniard here. See si, Guatemala. <laughs> Lou, do your damn good. thing. I was told to do the damn thing. Do the damn thing. It's got reposado. We love the reposado. Cheers. We made it. Centrada. We're celebrating Zan and Ed Tegran right now. What's up, buddy? Thanks, bro. It's good. I appreciate it. Yeah. Oh, I'm age now. Yeah. Look at that. Hey. Hello, Nick. I see you been eating my whole well. Too good. Too good. I see that, bro. Don't know my videos. I feel like this is like an intern. My videos? Yeah. They said they watch every single one on their videos. videos. are so we, good. We literally sit in our living room and we post it right on our TV and we're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's like the highlight of our day, honestly. All right, everybody. This speech is dedicated to my angel. No, for real. Congratulations, Nick, Anthony Zan, and others that have competed in the past. Congratulations on uh, enduring a prep successfully. I appreciate all you coming out. I know you all have busy shit to do. We're all pretty old these days, except you. With that said, you know, I hope you guys enjoy food. I enjoy having your company because I'm always busy. I do the same shit day in and day out. So being a part of this and being a part of other everything, I appreciate it, for real. So, cheers, congratulations on your big wins today. Yeah. Love you, bro. Love you, bro. That was good. Yo. Real quick, I'm gonna make this short and sweet because I know we just want to fucking eat. I just want to thank every single one of you guys for showing up. Make it an hour and a half drive. Some of you guys like literally do not need to do that. 18 weeks of dieting, one day. The whole journey only matters because you guys have been supportive of me the whole time. So every single one of you, every role that you guys played in my prep, this man, but all the way down the line, has meant the world to me. So thank you so much for being there for the both of us, for being there for every step of the way. Everybody, every single person that has called me in the last few weeks, you know how the phone calls went, and you know how I feel about you. So I just want y'all to know that sitting here and celebrating at every moment with you guys means way more than any trophy placing in the world. Today, tomorrow, two, three years from now, it's a relationship sitting at this table. So I love y'all. Eat fucking good, drink fucking good. Salud.
It's undeniable shit. It's just getting started, baby. So you gotta think we're one drop in, one alpha leech is in, and we're already, we're already at the moon. We're already at the moon. We're going out of, we're going out of solar system. Intergalactic. Undeniable. That's what we do. I don't know nothing else. I've been trying to tell y'all since the beginning now, we're like, oh, I want the first seed, I want the second seed. Y'all wasn't there. Believe in the dream, believe in the mission. If not, you're gonna get left. Get with it or get lost, bozo. Undeniable. I'm gonna eat like an absolute horse tonight. I love you, Zan. I can't wait to see everything you're gonna accomplish in the next two years while you grow. Thanks for being an awesome friend. Let's have a fucking night. Is it rolling? Ahem. <clears throat> Microphone check, one, two, one, two. Jake him in the crib. One, I am fucking hella proud of this kid. And number two, shout out to Lou for busting his ass because I know how hard it is to get these videos out and he's been grinding. But we're having a good night. We got a whole squad and we're just gonna enjoy the night. About to eat some good food and munch on some good ass cookies when we get back to the crib. What the fuck? <laughs> I was like, what is this? What are we doing? What's that? I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was good as hell. Good? That was good as hell. Zan's eating. I want to eat. My steak's right here. Let's chow down. Let's just eat. Talk to you later. Good? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? You don't know what I'm talking about, dude. We've been trying to reach you about your cars. I don't know. We're going to the Warranty. That place is good. Let's go drink somewhere. And find more food. Sally boys. Or go back to Brother Bruno's. I'm also unopposed to that. Who said Brother Bruno's? Back in the house. You actually have it? Yeah. Oh, good. It's good for you, too. It's Kyle Wilk Wilkes approved. I like eat a cracker and I can't fucking back in. It's rough. Can I eat still? <laughs> what? The road to 230, of course you could still eat. I know, so I was sorry. What's the best one? That's so we sweet. Get to it I haven't got to yet. Oh my god, the best one there. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Where's Pizza. Where's the red? Uh, Look. Uh, I, I've been thinking of the albums. Oh no. That was fire. We that good. Was nope. Oh. Was. Eat it. You know I will. Oh, this is yeah. This thing is breaking apart. Yeah. I ate so many cookies today. Holy fuck. It's all me. Peace. Uh, See you guys. guys. That was also a week. Ooh. Yeah, there's a lot of cookie in there. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we're going to end this video. This is kind of shameful. <laughs> I feel great, but um, this is not how I want it. Oh, no, I'll see you in the morning. Yesterday was um, the culmination of like a lot of work and a lot of moments and a lot of people supporting me, a lot of things to think about, you know, scars on my chest, the things I've been through, this, this prep, but not only just this prep, but the last couple of years, getting into this, this lifestyle and this sport. You know, I'm, I don't know, man, I'm so competitive by nature that I think when I played college football, I needed a vessel to put my physical energy into and, and, and compete. And, uh, you know, what I've learned in the last couple of weeks competing at Summer Shredding and now competing in an NPC show is that I, I love this shit and uh, this keeps me grounded. And um, I just want to share with everybody the journey and show that you can live, uh, live this lifestyle and still be successful in the corporate world. You can come back from injuries, you can come back from skin conditions, you can come back from anything and chase dreams, chase your reality. And uh, I'm just trying to create the most beautiful reality possible because there's such, such a short time on this planet Earth and I just want to make the most of it, enjoy every single moment of it uh, with the people that mean the most to me. Share that all with you guys. So I, I hope the words that I've said in between getting ready for the show and being on stage, now, you know, after, after the show, enjoy every moment. Be where your feet are because the present moment is super fleeting and you don't truly embrace that unless you have that mindset.
and then you allow moments like that to be with your family and friends, surrounded and huddled together, embracing what you've worked for and the beauties of life. You don't want to miss the, that shit. You don't want to miss that shit at all. We got more videos to make. We got more content to do. We have a lot of growing to do. We have a plan. We're gonna share that in the next video. But I hope you guys enjoyed this absolute movie that Luke puts together. Hope you guys enjoyed this whole prep series. And you're not ready for what's to come. Journey over destination.